Hello, this is Trisha from Sandy and Auto, and I have a Goodwill Thrifting unboxing uh, for you today. And uh, if you are new to my channel, please subscribe and click that notification bell so you'll be notified when I put out new video content and when I go live for my sales, which all of these items will be available in upcoming live sales, which are every Wednesday at 4 p.m. Eastern and Saturday night at 10 p.m. Eastern. Um, and also don't forget to click that uh, thumbs up button like on your way out. So here I have, um, let's see what this, this is a, like a little sea otter. And I was trying to see if it mentioned what he was made out of um, because he looks wood carved, but I think he was maybe molded or something, but he is really cute. Here, oh. So here we have a little, like a turtle, <laughs> excuse me, a turtle who is a bank. So he's got a little slot there. <laughs> Look at that little face. <laughs> and I have this little guy, which like is a little sled, really pretty decorated. This is a, like a little uh, ceramic pot. We've got a little scarecrow and all of the little vegetables growing. And this is, oh, Anesco, Vegetable Garden by Anesco. This was a very cool pair of bookends. Look at these horses. And they've got, I think that's the pen holder. Which one has? Oh, maybe this one has it right there, the pen holder. And it is marked um, Japan on the back there. But I just thought those horses were really nice. This one is like it was sounding like a bell, and sure enough, it is a bell. But since it was this beautiful blue and it's got the hobnails on it, I could not resist that one. Okay, and a picture. Now, I haven't had as much art in my sales lately, but I'm going to get back into it. Um, but look at this one. Isn't that lovely? <laughs> I love those animals. Um, so yes, I'm going to try to remember to pull out more art uh, because I love art, um, as you can see from the wall behind me. <laughs> and I love having art in my sale. And oh yeah, this one. This one is all engraved into this piece. Now, I had a similar piece, and I think that this is um, called Montana Marble. And I'll get in close. There. But all of that is engraved into this. Um, very talented artist who did all of that. And there's like four or five eagles in there. Now this one has a whole bunch of touristy kitsch that I could not um, I could not pass up. And this one, they put the darn sticker right on there so you can't see the cute image. Um, but I did find a whole bunch of snow globes. 
Um, they are like little tourist destinations, but I picked up the ones that were fun. And let me see if I can get this one. There it goes. So the cable car actually moves back and forth on that one. <laughs> this one is a calendar, so it does move, and that's New York. This one's also a calendar. That's Reno. Um, this one was just a really cute little sailboat there. And I think these are mostly marked like Hong Kong on the back. Here's a San Francisco, that's a calendar. And then this one, oh, again, they put the sticker right there so you can't see the whole image. I can get at least part of that off. Um, so this one is a like a Christmassy kind of one. There. Now I think you can see a little better of the image. I'll get that shaken up there. <laughs> so we've got the cute little girl and the fireplace, but it's got the little garland on it, so it looks like uh, Christmassy. And I think that's it for the snow globes that I found. And then oops, we've got this beautiful dog. Look at that. He is, again, a good-sized dog, but that is covered in um, some kind of a fur. But yeah, he's a beauty. All right. On to unpacking some more. And this one was double papered. And we've got this beautiful candy dish that is lovely with the little grapes pattern on there. And this, oh yeah, this one is Ainsley and it is koalas. So I am gathering together. I don't know why my Goodwill lately has had um, a lot of Australia items. So I'm probably going to save this one and uh, put it with the um, Australian sale that I'm going to do. <laughs> I thought it would be kind of fun to, to group all that stuff together and uh, have at least part of a sale be a little theme. Here is a wood carving of a horse. Isn't that gorgeous? And this is part of a set of candlesticks. Really nice, kind of that boho feel with that. And it doesn't look like the other one is in here, so we may find that at another unboxing. <laughs> and this is, oh, this looks like some kind of like a, mo a mobile where it would hang from the top maybe because there's all these birds on here and I can see some line here. So somehow we must be hanging this uh, piece so that all the birds can flop down and fly. But I just love how brightly colored they were painted. And then I've got this piece of art with this adorable puppy. And 
And I've got this. This is like an ad um, reproduction on tin, but it actually is from um, Spain. But I thought uh, she was looking pretty darn cute there. This is a penguin of some kind carved out of wood. And I have this set of turtles. Look at this. They all connect together there. And then they go for a ride. <laughs> but look how cute they are. And they are some kind of a wood that's been put together. Okay, and then I've got some doilies. So this is a, let's see, we've got a pink one and a cream one. And then we've got yellow, blue, and green. And then I wasn't kidding about my store having Australian stuff. So here's some more. Look at that with all the birds on it. And then the back is just red. And we've got the matching apron. Look at that with all the birds on it and the map. <laughs> Okay, over to this side to find these goodies. Let's see. This is nice. So this is a ceramic made to kind of look like wood, but that is a ceramic duck planter. And I've got two of these. So these were some kind of a promotional from KFC, Star Wars Studios, and it's got a Frisbee, which is a flying bucket topper and all of this stuff from uh, The Phantom Menace, 1999 KFC. And I had two of those and they were... Oh, I guess this one has two in there and then the parts, so there's different ones. And Yep, I guess this one did have two toppers in there also. I've got a stitching kit. Um, this one is Winter Days. Really fun outdoor activities. And the last one I have in here are the Seven Dwarfs. And these are marked um, Thailand on the bottom. But I just thought they were so cute and a really good size. And here I've got a flower frog. One of the nice ones for stacking marbles on. I've got the Fostoria, um, what is that, coin or is that medallion? I can't remember the pattern, uh, but it's got all of the American coins on it.
And then here we've got a beautiful candle holder. Get that lovely design in there. Gorgeous. And I've got the little nappy bowl. Let's see if I can get that off. Well, sort of. You can see the pattern underneath a bit. But again, that's got all of the um, like American coins with the eagle on there. And I have a vase. I love finding really interesting um, clear glass vases, ones that have lots of texture and design on them. Look at that one. Love that design. Okay, so that is that. So it looks like maybe I've got some uh, possible matching candlesticks out there somewhere still that I will find in another unboxing. Uh, so thank you for watching. And all of these items, again, will be kind of rotated into my sales. Uh, so again, uh, click that notification bell and subscribe to my channel so you'll be notified when I go live for my sales, which are, again, every Wednesday at 4 p.m. Eastern and Saturday at 10 p.m. Eastern. And don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. And uh, thanks for watching, and I will see you next time.